hello there and welcome back to the channel. In this video we are taking a look at how to use head tracking on the DJI Goggles Race Edition when used with the DJI Digital Ear System for FPV. Now DJI have included the option for head tracking and there's a couple of things you need to do and you will need another bit of equipment and I'm just going to talk you about getting it set up. So let's get on with it. Okay, so the way it is set up to work is DJI have put a spare port on the side of the air system located here. This port outputs a PPM signal for head tracking when using it with the DJI goggles. Now, because it is a PPM system, you're going to need to convert it to PWM. And that's where this little board here comes in. This is a multifunction signal converter. So this is the RMI LEC, so the RMI LEC signal converter version 3 and this converts PPM, SBUS and PWM signals whichever way you want them to and the setup is as simple as follows you go from the DJI Air system down to your converter with the PPM input and then you connect your head tracking to the servo output 1 and 2 off the board and that then gives you control from the system if you are using this converter, you will need to make sure you've set it to the correct mode because you need to tell it which input mode it's going to be and you simply do that by pressing and holding the button down whilst you power it on, selecting one of the three modes via the LEDs and then turning it off and that sets the mode for you. For the demonstration on this, I have it connected to a piece of plastic just so I can demonstrate it in use because this isn't currently on a fixed wing but it will be going on it later. Okay, the next thing we need to do is turn on head tracking in the menu for the goggles. So to do this, we simply enter the menu, scroll down to the head tracking options at the bottom, enter this, and you can now see we have a number of options. The top one is to turn gimbal head tracking on and off. So to turn this on, you simply slide it forward and the head tracking comes to life. The next option below it is the adjust gimbal offset. This allows you to adjust the position of the servos. And the third option is adjust gimbal sensitivity. And this is where you adjust how much reaction the gimbal has compared to the movement of your head. And you can increase and decrease this to make it more or less sensitive. Now that it's switched on, looking at it closely, you can see as I move my head left and right, the gimbal now reacts and follows the movement. As I look up, it tilts the gimbal up, and as I look down, it tilts the gimbal down. So it's as simple as turning it on in the menu, and then it kicks in straight away. Okay, just to demonstrate this externally, it's all turned on, and I simply move the goggles round, you can see that the head tracking kicks in as I move the goggles round on the desk and it is really as straightforward as that. So the basics are connect up the included PPM cable to your PPM to PWM converter, then connect your servos to your PWM converter and turn it on in the head tracking menu and it is as simple as that. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel and I will do another one again soon.